Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to record with a free software. Easy to download, no, virus, no viruses, which everybody really worries about, but I don't really think, especially me, I'm one of those guys. But there's no viruses, there's nothing you need to worry about, I promise you that 100%. Alright, so go into your Google search or whip out your tab, make a new tab, type in OBS, alright? I have a link in the description, alright? But um, the first thing it should be obsproject.com or open broadcast software with an index. And you have this screen. You hit Windows 7 slash 8, which will start the download. And once it's done downloading, you click it and you install it and press yes for like allow it on your computer. Do all that and you should be a good no viruses. If there's a virus or anything, tell me. And yeah, but I'm pretty sure there's no viruses on it. You'll be okay. All right, so after you're downloading this, OBS should pop up. All right, since I'm recording, I can't show you that much because there's only so much you can do while you're recording, all right? All right, so I'm recording. So you go to scene. This should both be blank. You see nothing here. So add scene, name it whatever you want, whatever you desire. Scene 2. All right, go to sources. It's going to be a black screen for now because I'm in a different scene. Just listen to my voice. All right. So you go to sources, right-click that, and do add. Now, for a full screen, um, to have full screen, you want window capture, or game capture, monitor capture, or something else. Well, uh, I use window capture, all right, and game capture, something like that, along those lines. So hit window capture, and you're gonna want to press OK with the name, and, and when, once you once blah, 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 once it pops up, you should see um a lot of these things, sub regions. You know, capture mouse cursor. You don't need to worry about these settings. They might be a little confusing to um, rookies or noobs. But if you want, pretty much when you record, like what I'm doing, you don't see my, you don't see the mouse cursor. So yeah. So just hit OK. Just have everything ready, and you'll be okay. All right now, you guys can see. See, I see. You guys see that I use monitor and game capturing. So you could use window game capture, game capture. I mean. Window capture, game capture, monitor capture, whatever you want. Honestly, one of those three, one of those three things, you should be okay. Now, when I first downloaded this, I had some pretty garbage quality, so I'm gonna help you guys out. So go to settings, right? All right, you want to go to settings, and general, just it's fine. Just keep it like that. Encoding. Now, this is for desktop recording, not game streaming or anything. So you want to. You, I'm pretty sure you're going to have to uncheck CBR. Get rid of that. This is usually for streaming, for like live streaming or recording games. So uncheck that if it is checked. Keep everything like this. Um, your max bitrate, if this is like a 1,000, put a 1,000. But I use 15,000 on 15,000. So if you guys want to use that, that's fine. Don't worry about your computer, it would be fine. So um, bitrate should be 128. Stereo for channel format should be 48. Um, KHZ and codec should be AEC. Right, now go to broadcast settings. Now you're you're gonna spawn in, or you know, once you come here, you're gonna have live stream. You don't want that. You want to go down to file output only, and pretty much browse. Just click browse and make a file, a folder. Because if you don't do that, it will go automatically Windows Movie Maker, and it would be garbage quality. So you want to make a file, which takes two seconds and yeah just you click browse right and just make a file or anything like that and download it into the folder and it should turn into a windows media player which you want all right come down to video um also every time just hit apply but i don't need to do that all right let's go back so now go to video um your video adapter should be um should have one video adapter if you have multiple choose the highest one you want custom so your resolution so this is my resolution at you can't change that also monitor if you have two monitors okay um resolution downscale if you want none if you have a bad computer you would hit a little bit of a down you want to go downscale and use best detail 36 samples but i'm going to stick with none FPS should stay 30 because even if you go higher, it's going to be kind of laggy for some computers, I think. Also, YouTube, pretty I'm pretty sure YouTube automatically does 30 FPS. Disable arrow because it pretty much, when you're trying to, it's going to cause a lot of lag and 
just it's gonna be irritating so you want to disable that audio you can play around with do whatever you want with audio um, hotkeys push to talk you know all that stuff but I don't want to do that start recording mine is F9 and F10 so you know you don't have to pop out the thing and click record and you know kind of ruins the video sometimes hit advanced stick with very fast stick with normal pretty much all the settings here if you want custom put C R F equals 20 I think you go to like 70 or something I don't know just you don't need to use that just keep it like this forget about this no custom all right it's pretty much everything and apply and this is just you know about your microphone quick sync and encoder just random stuff you could play around with um yeah it's pretty easy like that and it's yeah so that's really it if you guys have any questions and maybe some stuff that i didn't explain correctly just tell me in the comments and i'll help you out i'll make another video for um for you all right um if anything goes wrong just tell me and yeah that's pretty much it if this wasn't good enough just tell me all right and i'll make a brand new one and it'll be more explain like you know just better in explaining wise but i think this is the best i could explain so yeah i think that's that's pretty much all all you got to do so yeah you can mess around with it if you want do some settings um but that's pretty much all you got to do for desktop recording wise and i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope this helped you out good night and enjoy your day my friend